Hello and welcome back again to Editor's Training and Support. This is last module of Editor's Training and Support series. In this module, we are going to discuss about ethical guidelines and policies, what an editor should follow. Innovative publication is committed to uphold the integrity of scientific record, publication ethics and publication malpractice statement. It is based on the code of conduct and best publishing practices in scientific publications as recommended by ethical committees. Ethical committees will be discussing later on in this video. As an editor, it is important to uphold ethical standards and practices in your work and to check all the ethical guidelines very carefully before starting working. It includes the recommendation for the conduct reporting, editing and publication of scholarly work in medical journal and principle of transparency and best practices in scholarly publishing. Now, we'll be discussing ethics recommending bodies. So, all research and studies that involve the human need to have approval for the study from respective IRB, Institutional Review Board for Human Studies. Such kind of policies and regulations are designed by these five ethical bodies. So we'll start with number one, OASPA, Open Access Scholarly Publishing Association, DOAJ, Directory of Open Access Journals, COP, Committee on Publication Ethics, ICMJ, International Committee of Medical Journal Editors, WAME, World Association of Medical Editors. These bodies involve the approval of protocol from institutional committees and for, uh, should be followed in accordance with ethical standards of responsible committees on experimentation. We generally follow the latest core practices applicable in publishing scholarly study for editors and for journal publisher also as outlined by COPE core practices to maintain professionalism, integrity and adherence to ethical standards in publishing industry all editors must follow these ethical rules and procedures as mentioned by COPE. So we'll start with impartiality, transparency, then misconduct and plagiarism, authorship and contributorship, disclosure and conflict of interest, copyright and intellectual property, editorial board and review process, confidentiality and transparency. Let's start with number one, confidentiality and transparency. The editors must maintain the confidentiality of peer review process. Any data or analysis presented in submitted manuscripts should not be used in journal editors on research without the consent of author. And the editors must be unbiased during consideration of all manuscript proceedings for editorial process. They evaluate papers in regards to race, religion, gender, seniority, nationality, institutional affiliations of author, etc. Then next point is misconduct and plagiarism. Misconduct can include various parameters like plagiarism, data manipulation, data falsification, conflict of interest, biased reporting and unethical behavior. Plagiarism is false depiction of another's person, work, either words, ideas or expression as your own. It can occur when you incorporate someone's ideas into your own work without permission or without giving credit to that particular person. We at IP Innovative uh, use authenticate software to detect the plagiarism and duplicacy of publication material. Authorship and contributorship. Any potential conflict of interest that can affect an editor's objectivity or impartiality or decision when handling a submission should be disclosed. Editor should step aside from the evaluation process or look for another editor if there is any conflict of interest found in that particular paper. Copyright and intellectual property. Copyright regulations and intellectual property rights must be respected by editors. Copyright is legal right granted to the creators of original works of authorship fixed in a tangible medium of expression. They should make sure that any copyrighted item should not be used in the manuscript, including pictures, figures, or extensive quotations, have the correct permits and licenses. 
editorial board and peer review. COPE encourage fair, transparent and rigorous peer review and we generally adhere to the guidelines of COPE. So editors must lay down certain rules and regulations for their editing staff and peer reviewers as well. They should choose reviewers based on their experience, guarantee fair and objective uh, review and where necessary, secure the identities of both reviewers and authors. Disclosure and conflict of interest. The editor and members of editorial board of the journal shall not use unpublished material disclosed in a submitted manuscript for his or her own research without author exploitation written consent. Strong academic competitiveness between researchers or research group may result in biased editorial decision. So as an editor, you should be out of it as it can include personal, financial and professional conflict of interest. We ask all journal editors to make every reasonable effort to adhere to the following ethical guidelines for articles submitted for peer review in innovative publication. Hope you will find these videos and training series helpful and informative. Thank you so much for being a part of this series of training and videos. For more details, you must visit our website www.ipinnovative.com slash guidelines slash editor or www.mprp.in. Thank you so much.